Hello, I'm Taylor, and here are today's headlines from Pink 60. 61-year-old swimmer Diana Nayeb left Cuba Sunday evening to start a 103-mile swim to Florida. She hopes to break the 1979 world record, which she also set for long-distance swimming. <clears throat> you can keep track of her progress on Twitter. The last known gay survivor of the Nazi death camps has died aged 98. Rudolf Brasdor was liberated in 1942 and spent the rest of his life living in the Alsace region of France. Rudolf passed away peacefully in his sleep. Singapore Pride got underway over the weekend with an art exhibition and a mixed sports event. The gala reception and concert took place on Sunday and this week features a selection of queer films. The festival finishes next Saturday with a literary event and a youth forum. The Tasmanian Labour Party have supported a motion to adopt same-sex marriage as overall Australian Labour Party policy. This highlights just how out of step Julia Gillard is with the Labour rank and file, said Tasmanian Queer Rights Group spokesman Rodney Croom. And finally, star of the Harry Potter films and the History Boys, Richard Griffiths is to appear opposite Robert Lindsay in the new BBC sitcom titled George and Bernard Shaw. According to a British newspaper, the pair will play an older gay couple in the show which should air next year. That's all from us today, so join us again tomorrow.